Hey homies, how's it going? Welcome to another Weird Wednesday where I don't really know what to do, so we're just gonna go ahead and wrap, you know? So anyway, real quick, I'm assuming that I did this on Monday. So, seeing how it's Wednesday, I am looking back to the past and saying, hey, I want to thank Brent Bagbo for coming out to Tombstone to hang out. You know, um... And uh, once again, I want to apologize because I didn't realize that uh, the time I planned to do, do our get together for anybody who wanted to come down was the same time as uh, Born Free, you know? <laughs> it was bad planning, you know? I know a lot of the West Coast cats would have totally liked to hang out, but, you know, there was a better party going on, you know? So, hey, it. That's how it goes sometimes, right? But anyway, before I get too far into the weeds, um, as I like to do sometimes on uh, just when I'm just kind of goofing around, is uh, I like to introduce you guys to some music that I'm kind of into, you know, and see maybe if you guys are into it, you know? So uh, I'm going to play for you guys uh, this band from Canada. They're called the Flatliners. Um, they'll be playing in the background. I'll do the best to uh, ensure the sounds or qualities are good, you know, so it's not interrupting too much uh, to what we're trying to talk about. But um, they will be playing in the background. Um, the song right here means a lot to me. It's called Eulogy. It reminds me of a really good cat that I used to know. He helped me a lot when I was, uh, you know, a little bit though coming up, trying to learn how to do motorcycles. My homeboy Dave. Uh, that dude, you know, coming up in the motorcycle scene, that guy was like, oh, you know, like a local legend, you know, he knew, he forgot more than I'll ever know. Let's just say that, you know? But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and play the song, you know, in honor of Dave, you know? Obviously this, <laughs> this video is gonna get uh, copyright claimed, but whatever, I don't care, you know? It's not like I'm making money off it anyway. And I don't, Ultimately, who cares about the money, you know? I just want to do this, you know, see you back, talk to you guys, you know, reminisce about stuff. But without further ado, let's go ahead and uh, let them play us in. And uh, let me see here. Is everyone lost? <laughs> That's not the right song. There we go. This is the eulogy. For some reason I decided to skip around. I'm playing out of the old boombox. But anyway, here's to you, Dave, wherever you are. Okay. Well, I'll catch up to you someday, right? Almost. My bad, homies. So anyway, Tombstone was a lot of fun. Uh, I appreciate the people that, uh, you know, if you couldn't come out, you guys said so and stuff. And, you know, the people that did come out, I appreciate you guys. I uh, had a good time, like I said, to hang out with Brown Bad Go. Um, homies got a pretty cool bike. And, um, you know, if, if you're not following him, he's on Instagram, Brand Bag Bo. Uh, spelled like, you know, like um, B-A-U. My bad, bro. <laughs> I'm not good at spelling, homie. But anyway, I'm sure you'll drop a comment down below where you can follow him on Instagram. He's got a cool FXR that you guys got to check out, you know. I'm really looking forward to riding with him on the FXR, man. That thing is sick, homies. But anyway, back to uh, what I wanted to talk about on this weird Wednesday, you know. Aside from the music, you know. Let me turn this down just a little bit more, you know, so I can, you know, talk. Um, like I said, I made a mistake. I didn't really think about the fact that uh, Born Free was going on at the same time. But, you know, that's besides the point, you know. It's like I still want to keep doing, like, the motorcycle, mo uh, the motorcycle videos. Still want to do these, like, you know, like, variety show Wednesdays where I like, you know, if I don't really have anything, I'll just talk to you guys, you know. And I hope you guys enjoy that, you know. If not, we'll, we'll figure out something else that you guys enjoy more, you know. But anyway, 
And then Fridays, I, I want to get back into doing the movies, you know. Um, fun, uh, fun fact, I had a dude hit me up talking about, like, um, uh, a movie review I did a little while ago for the Apocalypse movies. Um, and he's like, hey, you should check this out. And also, I have another dude that's been, like, uh, telling me a lot of times, you know, I need to check out uh, Roma on uh, Cell 99. So, I got to check out those two movies and then do a review for them, you know. You know. You gotta do what the guys want, you know? So anyway, I'm on it, guys. That's all I'm trying to say, you know? But, uh... Let's see here. So your old homeboy is, um... He's not too happy with the way, uh... Things are going. He's kind of a little freaked out. He's not gonna lie, you know? There's a lot of uh, things that he's not really digging, you know, so um, he's been looking at things, he's been looking on the internet, and uh, there might be uh, a whole new chapter to this whole uh, endeavor, you know, if things keep going the way they're going, you know, um, I'm thinking about getting a boat, you know, something more than just a... You know, a little boat like I got down here in Sonora for me to go fish off of, you know. Being about a good sized boat to kind of get away from it all, you know. But I'll still be making videos. I'll be still talking to you guys. I'll still try to do the best I can at all the things I'm trying to cover, you know. But, you know, these are just plans. These are just ideas I'm throwing against the wall. I'm going to see what sticks, you know, Holmes. But anyway... Winter's coming quick. I know a lot of you guys don't live in uh, the climates I do where, like, you know, I can ride year-round because, like, you know, it doesn't get cold. It's going to rain a lot, but lots of hurricanes. Tell me what you're going to do, right? But anyway, so it's, it's building season, right? And uh, there's a couple of people, you know, as it comes down, there's a couple of people I've been talking to, you know, again on Instagram. <coughs> I don't think um, you'll get too upset about it, but there's a uh, homeboy. Uh, was, what, what's his handle on uh, YouTube or um, Instagram? It's uh, California uh, McFun. You know, you should get, you guys should check him out. He's got a cool little uh, sport he's putting together, an iron head, man. And uh, legit, I really want to go right with that dude because he's got a cool ride, you know. But anyway, other things I've been kind of watching is, um, you know, and this dude, okay, the guy I'm going to tell you about right now has absolutely no affiliation with the channel in any way, shape, or form. I don't actually know him in any way. We don't really talk, you know, like, I'll give him the kudos on his on his videos or whatnot, and, you know, thumbs up stuff, you know, he, he gives me the, the canned response, you know, but uh, there's this dude, he's out of uh, SoCal, um, he's the editor for uh, Deluxe uh, car, car Culture. He's got this really cool show. His name is, uh, the dude's name is Spike Marble. But he's got this really cool show on uh, YouTube. It's called Spike's Breezeway Cocktail Hour. And homeboy is into tiki's more than I am, homies. And this vato, he's got like the whole setup. <coughs> Excuse me, there's a lot of pollen or something in the air. These cactuses, they're just, you know. The thing in the air, you know? <laughs> but anyway, like, let me just get through this real quick and let me tell you about this guy. This Vato's pretty sick, man. He does a whole different cocktail every day, every week, Fridays. He tells you all about it. But, like I said, the channel is Spikes, Spikes Breezeway Cocktail Hour. You guys need to check it out. Dude's feeding me. He's got a lot of cool stuff on his uh, on his web page. Um, he's actually in a band also. If you're into like you know like um, the uh, you know 
the Hawaiian, like, I wouldn't call it Hawaiian, but the island sound, you know, but, like, 50s style, like, you know, like, um, old school, like, you know, like, um, Don Ho kind of stuff, you know, but Homeboy's got his band, it's called the Hula Girls, you guys should check them out, they're pretty feeding me homes, um, he's got his album for sale on there, it's, uh, limited edition, uh, 10 year anniversary right now, and, uh, really cool uh blue foam kind of like sea foam color you know so if you get a chance to check it out you know that's what i've been into lately you know but anyway like i said i just wanted to touch base with you guys you know i didn't do anything for a whole week um i'm assuming i did a video for motorcycle monday you know this is coming out wednesday no matter what but I'm working on my Motorcycle Monday video, you know, which will hopefully have a little bit of footage from my trip to uh, Tombstone. Obviously, it's not going to have too much because, uh, granted, I'm just one dude with one camera, you know. I'm trying to expand, but it is what it is right now for what it is, you know. So, uh, I appreciate you guys still tuning in and watching what I got to say and whatnot. You know, you guys are feeding my homes. But anyway... Like I said, I'm going to let you go for right now. I'm going to go get back to listening to some music, you know. <clears throat> Excuse me. Like I said, <laughs> it's the end of the year. Pollens are getting to me a little bit, you know. But anyway, I right, watch your homes. Feed me. And you all have a good night. Good rest of your week. Good rest of September. If I don't see you again, I will. I'll be here, but you know, if you guys don't tune back in. But anyway, like I was saying, feed me homes. I love watch you.